What's up guys? So many of us XRP holders, including me, waited so long for the US court to rule that Ripple's XRP is not a security. Immediately after this ruling, we saw the price of XRP skyrocketing towards the upside. We went to 94 cents in just a few hours, and this equates to an inflow of capital of roughly 20 billion US dollars. Upon the release of this fantastic news, many of us immediately bought XRP, including me. By the way, here you can see a long position that I opened at this time and I share this in my trade signal group if you want to be part of it as well and be more profitable then check out the links in the video description unfortunately in the days after we saw the price of XRP declining a lot from basically 94 cents all the way down to 68 cents this has to do with the rumors that the SEC is planning to file an appeal against Ripple XRP in the coming weeks in today's video guys I want to show you in the charts why I think that this is a bad time to sell your XRP before we dive in guys as always hit the like button to support the channel make sure to follow me on twitter at steph underscore is crypto let's dive right in observing xrp on the weekly time frame using the binance chart we can actually see that xrp started a significant uptrend here basically from off the 13th of june 2022 when the price was 28 cents xrp formed consecutive higher highs and higher lows and we saw a real explosion towards the upside after the news came out that the sec lost the court case against ripple xrp so we saw a significant weekly candle here towards the upside touching the 94 cent price level which was the golden Fibonacci ratio the 0.618 Fibonacci level here marked in white since then we saw a rejection to the downside and XRP is currently trading at 69 cents so let's actually calculate the next areas of support for XRP in case we see a further decline to the downside so I'm going to sketch out the Fibonacci retracement from the low point here of this green candle towards the high point of 94 cents and let's actually give this another color let's actually make this orange so let's go here let's make it orange and let's remove this from the chart so here in orange you can actually see all the relevant fibonacci support levels for xrp i would say the lowest i could see xrp going is 60 cents in case we lose the 60 cent price level with multiple weekly candle closes then it's getting very unlikely that we are going to see continuation to the upside but as long as we're holding weekly candle closes above 60 cents then i would still expect further upside to come for xrp in the next few weeks personally guys i think this is a very bad time to sell your xrp obviously i'm not a financial advisor and always do your own research before you invest your money or before you start to sell something but if we start to close multiple weekly candles below 60 cents then i think it's getting very unlikely for us to see continuation towards the upside but as long as we are staying above this level above the highs that we've made here at the beginning of 2023 then i still think that we are going to see continuation towards the upside we've obviously broken the downtrend and i think the bear market has ended for xrp be back in June 2022 so watch out for that 60 cent price area if we go to 59 cents or 58 cents that's not a big deal but as long as we're not closing multiple weekly candles below the 60 cent area then I still do expect continuation forward in case we go higher watch out for 75 cents that's the first area of resistance that we need to break through the next one obviously 94 cents and eventually one dollar and 30 cents and eventually the high that we've set back in april 2021 at $1.96 so those are the imminent areas of resistance for xrp and personally i do think that in the next few weeks next few months we are going to take out some of these high points if you're interested in purchasing or trading xrp then make sure to use my bitget affiliate link found in the video description my link grants you bonus rewards up to 5000 us dollars for free to claim all you need to do is sign up an account with my specific link follow the deposit requirements and claim your free bonus rewards for those of you who are not aware bitcat has some of the lowest tra trading fees among most of the exchanges out there and with my specific link you will receive an additional 15 percent for a lifelong period of time on all your trading fees so definitely worth to check it out let's also briefly analyze the momentum for xrp to see if the momentum is currently still looking healthy so on the weekly time frame for xrp the rsi is still looking healthy rsi following the trend creating a higher high here while the price also 
outperformed higher highs. So no bearish divergence and we're currently sitting at 68 on the weekly RSI. So we're not overbought either. So there's still a lot of potential to grow higher in price. Same thing applies to the MACD indicator. MACD is following the trend. Momentum is very bullish at the moment. So personally, I don't see any weakness at this stage. And I still think that XRP will go higher in the next few weeks, next few months. There's a possibility that we are going to see more sideways price action or a slight pullback in the short term. But eventually, I do expect this trend to continue higher. There was also a lot of volume here on this previous weekly candle. So that's also very good to see. So um, yeah, to me, it's looking still very good for XRP. And that was it for today's update video on XRP. Hopefully, you found this video helpful. If you did, let me know in the comment section below. Also, like the video, subscribe to my channel. I want to thank all of you guys for watching. And I see you in the next XRP update. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you.